welcome back to this FIFA series as the season is starting to wind up only three matches to go and we host Crystal Palace today it's in James's Park there's not much more to fight for in the season if we're honest three games to go we can't get in that top five spot but maybe we can stop others from getting what they want and hopefully we'll finish as high up the table as we can finish in the top 10 at least when it looked like we we're going to get relegated at one point so it's got to be considered a little bit of a positive if we can finish in that top 10 team wise after losing two games in a row it's pretty much the whole team has been changed only Tim Krull has survived that onslaught of changes giving some youngsters a go giving some players that haven't had too many games this year a go just pretty much changing it all about we've got an FA Cup final coming up haven't we so we've got to give everyone a chance to have a go in there of course we play against our former player Johan Kabay and our former manager Alan Pardew so hopefully we can give them a bad time today and thankfully in the second half we started giving them a bad time it was a beautiful volley from Wisnaldum and perfectly worked down the side put in a cross and which now them just ran on and bang no one is going to save that from that distance any further out and out has gone over the stadium so he's lucky that he's that close to the goal when he's smacked that one but either way we've actually got three points we've had Crystal Palace come to us and we get to leave with three points three very healthy points as we just look to finish the season off in better form than we started it. Uh, nice handshakes, nice team spirit from both teams. Which now I think we'll be back in the team for the next game. And that next game is away. We're off to Villa Park, off to Aston Villa, off to try and get three points from Villa who are near us again, their team just like us nothing left to fight for so this could end up being quite a dull game of two teams just going well you know season's over can't really go up can't go down can't do anything so we'll just go out there and play for pride hopefully Tim Krull being captain that might give away that uh, there's a few changes here today of them and they've got Charles Zobbia, a former player, a player that was should have played playing with Newcastle, Jordan Ayew, should have joined us before the last manager joined, before I joined the management. The last manager should have signed him, is what I'm trying to say. But anyway, changes, seven changes. So it's the winning side, are you mad? No, I just want to give players a chance at the end of the season, chance to get into the team, chance to have a chance in the FA Cup final I think everyone deserves a chance to fight for that position and I think we know who exactly who seems to be winning a place in the team at the moment Judy Wijnaldum coming up with the goods at the end of the season perfectly lovely passing movements from the team just in out gets it to Wijnaldum and then just looks up back post just finesses it there boom not doesn't need the power just going to place it there bang 1-0 Newcastle thank you Genie Wisnowdom and that is the way it ended winning 1-0 two wins in a row going into our final game of the season and then it's the FA Cup final so until then I'll see you next time